Manchester Community Youth Orchestras of Boston, a select group of nine of 70. And we, I suspect, got the creme de la creme this evening. And I thank you all very much. And we'll be hearing a little bit more about you and about the founder and conductor, director, Deborah Carson. But now, press or no press, I got a schedule to keep. So I'm going to start the program. And I, I just wish to welcome you all to the 2011 Arlington International Film and Video Poster Contest Press Conference and Reception. Thank you all for joining us here this evening uh, for the announcement of the winner of this year's AIFVF Arlington International Film and Video Festival. Thank you for coming to, see, uh, to have unveiled here this evening the winner of the poster contest and uh, the, this is also the official kickoff of the 2011 festival, which will take place October 6th through 9th, 2011, at the Regent Theater in Arlington Center. I have to say, I have, it took me seven years to convince my wife to put together this project, this idea. And then I met Walter. And Way together, finally, he nailed perfectly. Now we are the three amigos here. In this <laughs> um, I've always shared uh, a love for film, and I what what really excites me about film is not necessarily the entertainment, but the communication from different countries and cultures. That is. Um, Communication to me, it, that's what my life is about. That's what I value. And I am very happy um, to be uh, producing this uh, film festival with Walter and Alberto. So thank you. We look forward to other events between now and October um, where we will have the grand finale in October at the region. So thank you. Thank you so much for coming. The judges and I had a set of criteria for which we were on the lookout in these posters. First, we looked for artwork that spoke to the theme and contained the necessary information about the upcoming festival, the dates, the title, and all that stuff. Then we looked for the strong graphic qualities that are important for a public poster. Eye-catching, not too cluttered, well-designed. There were quite a few that fit that bill, and we came down to 10 of the strongest posters for the finalists. These were all creative and visually engaging with many compelling features. The winner, however, I am pleased to say, was one that all the judges were immediately drawn to. It is unusual to have such a strong consensus, consensus of opinion among five judges, but the winning entry is well-designed, graphically very engaging, and quite original in its concept. Bravo to all the teams who entered the competition. Congratulations to the top ten, and thank you to all of you for your participation. So now I get to unveil the winner, this is true. The winning poster, that is. So, <clears throat> may I have the envelope, please? <laughs> okay, the winning name is Jared Blazer. $500 to the winner of this year's poster contest. We congratulate Jared, and this is his poster, and please uh, enjoy all the posters that you see around here. Now, hold on, because <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, this concludes the press announcement. Please join us now for the reception and enjoy the food and drink so generously donated for this event by local establishments.